at the side of the California Gold Rush steamer Winfield Scott, a sidewall steamer that was heading from San Francisco to Panama in 1853. It was rumored that she was on a race with another Pacific Mail Steamship Company steamer, the Sierra Nevada. Encountering fog mid-channel, the captain chose to continue at 11 knots passing through Anacapa Island and Santa Cruz Island. As the fog set in, he chose not to alter his course or slow the ship down, and in turn, struck this rock to the right of me here. As you followed the light up, the steamer hull was ripped out, and the Captain Simon Blunt decided to give the command to attempt to back out the ship. And in doing so, his rudder backed into the same rock, disabling it, the ship losing all possible steering was doomed to never leave the spot. And as you can see here, this is probably remnants of either white oak or live oak. If you examine closer, You'll actually see in the light here what seems to be wood was actually copper. The copper served as a barrier from the wood boring Torino worms that do occupy the sea. Today, little remains of the Winfield Scott, but what we can learn from her, what structure that we're seeing now is how these ships were built in the 19th century.